Hello and welcome to Cinemania. My name is Ellis Charles Hoffmeister and this is a video podcast diary something of sorts where I sometimes talk about film twice a week. I think we're at twice a week. That's basically what it is. So recently I watched a whole bunch of things but what I'm going to talk about today is Evil Dead Rise the fifth film in the Evil Dead trilogy, and Hot Fuzz, which is the second film in what I just found out are what uh, Simon Pegg and Nick Frost refer to as the, and probably Edgar Wright as well, you know, the director, referred to as the Three Flavors Cornetto trilogy, based on the Cornetto ice cream that is referenced in Shaun of the Dead, Hot Fuzz, and um, The World's End. At World's End? Whatever it's called. I think it's The World's End. That's the Pirates of the Caribbean movie I'm thinking of. Um, Which is all that. So there's that. Um, Evil Dead Rise. It's a lot of fun. Um, And Hot Fuzz, a lot of fun as well. I've seen... These are two movies, actually, that the theme of today is that they are movies where I had seen bits and pieces of them and had fallen asleep or watch them late at night or after a little bit of drinking or something. So I hadn't seen the whole thing. I had seen the beginning and the end of Evil Dead Rise. Um, And so I went back and watched it. And when I first kind of watched it, I was not as in love with it as everyone else, but that was because I fell asleep, just like Spring Breakers. I fell asleep in Spring Breakers and um, was like, I don't know if I loved it or hated it. And then I went back and watched Spring Breakers and it was delightful. So, um, Evil Dead Rise is a lot of fun. It's super gory, um, which is really great. That, um, kitchen device sequence, which I will say for those that are squeamish, is nightmare-inducing for a long time, and even now I'm going, ugh. Um, but it was really fun because it, uh, it really, you know, it lived up to the gory gnarliness, gory gnarliness of, um, the rest of the Evil Dead series which are a lot of fun. The performances were great. The story is a lot of fun. The gore is wild. Um, Bruce Campbell has two cameos in the film. Um, One involving that eyeball thing, uh, (laughs) which you'll just have to look up if you haven't seen it. And another that was a vocal cameo when um, one of the characters is listening to the recitations on vinyl that are found. Um, But overall, you know, Evil Dead Rise is just, it's a rollicking great time. If you love the originals, I think you'll have a lot of fun with it. Um, It's very, very violent and gory, which if you're a fan of the original and all of the sequels, then you're going to love it. Um, I still have not watched Ash vs. Evil Dead, the series, which I need to. This film was made in, you know, they didn't end up having a fourth season of that show. So they made, um, and they also talked about having a sequel to the Evil Dead uh, remake that Fetty Alvarez did, um, which is terrifying, by the way. It's one of the scariest things on the planet, Um, the the remake of Evil Dead. I saw it in the theater. and uh delightful uh terrifying don't breathe is also amazing if you've never seen don't breathe uh i went into a theater seeing don't breathe and i knew nothing about it and was not prepared at all for what i was about to watch um and it scared the living crap out of me and i have never made a bigger yelp of fear than i have in the film don't breathe um hot fuzz is a lot of fun it has so many great actors i remembered I thought I remembered what happened in the film because I had seen some of the ending and I did not remember all of it. And it has a very, very fun twist in that film. And also the references to Straw Dogs, which is a favorite, um, hysterical, uh, just with that one actor. Kate Blanchett's secret cameo, a lot of fun. Um, it's a who's who of actors that are everywhere. Olivia Coleman, Lucy Punch, um, uh, Rice Ivan's like it's just incredible it just has an incredible group of people so if you love Shaun of the Dead you should definitely see Hot Fuzz you've already probably seen Hot Fuzz because it came out right after um it's midweek I hope everyone's doing well and um yeah I found a sort of white background to do this against so there uh go watch Don't Breathe if you want to be terrified as balls so there and if you don't you can watch scared 
stiff for scared silly. I think it was scared stiff, which is a Dean Martin and uh, um, Jerry Lewis film that I just watched. So that's your non scary recommendation. Or just watch Hot Fuzz. It's not, you know, it's bloody, but it's not scary. There's murder. It's a horror comedy. You'll love it. It's great. It's like police action. It's fun. Okay, have a great week. Bye.